Hello, my name is Mark Powell, um, co-author of My Steam Engine is Broken. Today I'd like to talk a little bit about one of the paradoxes that we write about in the book, the paradox of efficiency. In the last 25 years, I've worked with hundreds of organizations trying to improve their performance. And often that's focused on cost and reducing costs and in increasing efficiency. But I become increasingly worried around the focus on efficiency and how it actually is affecting profitability in the wrong way. Let me, let me give you an example. I worked with a company a few years ago and they went through a very, very difficult period of time that meant they had to, to reduce costs very, very quickly. And what happened absolutely terrified me when I saw what happened. And it went something like this. If you imagine this in kind of one week, although this happened over you know, many weeks, but imagine it's in one week and this is literally what happened. On Monday, 5,000 people were fired. On Tuesday, the first corporate jet was sold. On Wednesday, another 5,000 people were fired. On Thursday, the second corporate jet went. Nearly 20,000 people lost their jobs before the final corporate jet went. And I just thought, you have got to be kidding. How are we living in a world where organizations think that a corporate jet is still more important than 5,000 people? Now, I've looked at lots of other organizations looking at the whole issue around how they approach and think about efficiency. And one thing that uh, I think happens a lot is what I call the fruit bowl effect. What I mean by the fruit bowl effect? This is what I mean by the fruit bowl effect. Many, many organizations, when they hit difficult times, market moves down, maybe they're just having you know, a difficult period, market's moved on, doesn't really matter. What's really interesting is how fast they go to bottom line cutting. And they don't just do sensible things, they do what I call the fruit bowl effect. They take the fruit bowls away first. Why? Because it's easy and quick to do and it makes them feel better. But the interesting thing around this process is, if you look at an organization from a human perspective, in difficult times, it's probably one of the worst things you can do. Because the only way you're gonna get out of a difficult period if you're an organization is by leveraging the power and the energy and the commitment of your people. And there is nothing worse than destroying that effect than removing the fruit bowls. And there are hundreds of examples of organizations who do this. Not the way to go forward. And we need to rethink the whole concept around the, the engagement of people when times are hard and look at the efficiency paradox because it's not by cutting that we increase the efficiency, it's by focusing on the quality of the people we've got to get us out of the messes we get ourselves into.